Engineering offices at small industrial equipment companies seek to quickly develop innovative components while reducing the cost of IT and infrastructure. Let's suppose that we work for a company called Follow the Sun Consulting, an engineering office providing services to industrial equipment manufacturers. This company, based in the UK, works with OEMs that design and produce flexible production systems for the food and beverage industry, like Sidel in France or Kroners in Germany, as well as with other companies in industries such as chemical, cosmetics or even the perfume industry. Today we're going to focus on a specific project that FTSC is working on with a company called Blue Fill Industries. Let me introduce the Blue Fill Industries company. This company manufactures bottling lines, such as this one, which is composed of four machines to rinse, fill, close and label bottles. Let's have a look at the filling machine. The carousel is made up of 28 filling units. Blue Fill Industries provides engineering services to the FTSC engineering office for the carousel's filling unit. As you can see from Alan's homepage, a professional dashboard displays key information related to his ongoing activities, such as, on the left, the engineering projects Alan is working on, on the right, the tasks he has to complete, and in the middle, you can see the collaborative space that hosts the collaboration with the OEMs. Let's have a look at the one dedicated to the filling unit engineering project. There are several people sharing information there. John is the Filling Unit Engineering Project Manager at FTSC. Mike is the Product Manager in charge of the bottling line at Blue Fill Industries. Back to Alan's dashboard. A widget provides him with the latest entries posted in the social communities he belongs to. One click on the post and he understands that Mike from Blue Fill Industries is asking for a modification in the project due to a new carousel. Let's see how he managed to do the job. A click in the West Quadrant gives him access to the 3D design applications. Alan is working on the filling unit of the carousel, which is provided by Blue Fill Industries. To reduce costs, he uses data from previous projects, as well as standard parts from catalogues. He has access to the Business Essentials applications. He can visualise key information and understand how the job is progressing. We can see the carousel in dark blue, some standard parts in light blue and Alan's own design in green. At any time, Alan can check if he's working with the most up-to-date data. In this example, in red, we notice that he's not using the latest version of the carousel. Not be the only one working on a project, and it's key for him to be aware in real time if some modifications have been implemented by other players. Alan updates his work in progress with the new design of the carousel and will now evaluate the impact of the changes on the filling unit. A quick measure shows new dimensions to take into account with a gap of 100 millimetres related to the new design. Thanks to knowledgeware and intelligent design, this is very easy to do. By editing the profile of the frame, he propagates the modification to the part, making the connection between the filling unit and the carousel. His next step is to update the assembly with an automatic repositioning of the components thanks to engineering connections mechanisms. Then, Alan uses an engineering template containing knowledge and company standards to engineer the components located at the bottom of the filling unit. He can choose between different piston sizes and obtain an automatic re-engineering of all the related components.
As you can see, tubing engineering is fully integrated. Tubes have also been updated, keeping the same connectors in the carousel. The newly modified pipe lengths will also be reflected in the drawing. Now let's update the drawing to take into account the modification and automatically generate the bill of materials. To complete the design, let's create the 28 instances of the filling unit that are positioned around the carousel. Alan has done the job. He can close the task he was assigned by John, the project manager. He can promote it to the review state so that John, the project manager, can be aware of his progress. Let's now see how this affects John, the project manager. John is in charge of several engineering projects for different OEMs. The filling unit is one of them. To ensure that everything is fine, John will now enter the project definition using the project management application from the North Compass. As you can see, we're currently in the preliminary design phase of this new filling unit. As we look closer, John can track and monitor the project, including a detailed status of each task. Here is the task Design Solution that is assigned to Alan with its review state. John can make sure that all information is well prepared. Satisfied with the job Alan did, John will promote the task to the Complete status. Via a dedicated social community, John and Alan can communicate with Mike, the product manager on the OEM side at Blue Phil Industries, in a secure environment and thus keep track of the various discussions. A click on the North Compass and John can access with the social and collaborative applications all the communities he belongs to. Looking at the one dedicated to the filling unit, John has captured from the beginning the meetings, reviews or discussions that took place with Alan and Mike. Using the multidimensional tagging mechanism, John can easily filter and navigate through the information captured in the community. Looking at what Mike posted related to the carousel, John will find the post related to the modification of the carousel. He'll then complete the discussions to mention that the job of the filling unit is done. Thank you.